Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of Jupiter Plays All the Games, this time with the Unity 3D in Espanol Game Jam Classical Day Avery and Hoy. Um, probably said that wrong. This is, as you can tell, a Spanish speaking game jam. It's done by a Spanish speaking community. Um, I'm playing all of the games that were entered in it in this video probably not going to understand some of them. I don't speak very much Spanish. Um, the translated theme is yesterday and today's classics. So it seems to be sort of based on retro games. The idea is to make a game based on or inspired by some classic or retro games uh, and making a game based on that. It can be based on more than one game. It's fine. This video is brought to you in part by the lovely people on Patreon who support me. So if you'd like to support me, there'll be a link in the description. And if you want to check out these awesome games, there'll be links in the descriptions to each of them. Thank you very much for watching and liking and commenting. We're playing Agent QB. Alright. These are controls. WSD, R to recharge. We've got different weapons probably. Interact is control. Space, sure. Nope, it's this one. This will be fun. I know the objectives. Kill the boss, escape through the elevator. I got that. Difficulty. Very easy. Muy very, very easy. Right. Alright, so we can switch through our different weapons this way. They're both dead. Oh, we don't need to look at that. Alright. Wow. Why are you, how are you shooting me? Your, like, arm isn't even raised. That's okay, though. Ooh. He, like, shoots a lot. Was he the boss? You kind of look like a boss. I feel like there's a lot of people in this room, and I do not know where any of them are. So let's go around this way. He must not have been lost, he must have been like a lawyer. I'm not sure what our health is or anything. I'm just shooting everyone. Oh, are you shooting me through the glass? Who else is- oh, you're shooting me. Oh, you're shooting me as well. And everyone in there. Wow, there's a lot of people in this office. I'm gonna have to, like, kill a lot of humans. Ah, there's more people in that office, even. There's just a lot of people. Next. We're playing Moon Survival. Let's make... Let's see what the instructions are. Um, A, W, A, D. Sure. W. W, A, D. No S. E, Shift, A, Shift, D. Well, that's a bit weird. And then bar, space bar. Probably. I mean, we'll probably figure it out. Ah, we can shoot. We shoot where our mouse is pointed. Let's go up here. There we go. So far, so good. I like the graphics in this game a lot. I think that this alien space slug looks cute. That was our dash, I think. That means to jump. There we go. Killed that. Oh, it made like a really cute purring noise when I like didn't do well. I have to sort of throw this over, I think. Alright. Does that work? Is that what I needed to do? It looks like it was. Huh. It's a very interesting platformer. I'm not sure what to do from here if I miss something. Hmm. Next. We're playing Cuppy Chill. Copy chill. It says copy chill on the game page. I want to play. It looks like this game has multiple endings and was made in just 12 hours, which is pretty cool. Spacebar jump. Q no 
to endless drones. Don't run into the drones. Maybe. I don't know what that says. I'm going to assume it means avoid drones. Um, we have these. We can throw them with K. And then maybe detonate them with Y or with J. Okay, puedes. Puedes is a verb that has lots of different endings. Aquarium. Oh my god. I don't know what this says. Oh, it must have worked though because all the water's gone. Um, continue, probably. I like picked it up, shot it, and then dropped it. <laughs> Not very good. And then I just dropped it again instead of shooting it. Stop dropping it. Yay. Oh. Nope, one hit and you're dead. I feel like I'm doing a very bad job at showing off these games. Which is how I feel at most game jams that I don't quite understand. Yep, we've got drones. I like the slight animation on my robot's head. That's quite nice. Ooh. There we go. Don't know how we did this bit, but we'll... I'll hit Y a couple of times just for good measure. Pick it up, throw it down, pick it up, hit that, throw it down. Ah, so maybe it's just like a grenade and when I throw it correctly, it's like, eh, death. You know, I th oh, we should have gone the other way. But I wanted my gun and I wanted to kill it. Next. We're playing Helga's Dreams and Fears. It looks like you can use an Xbox 360 controller with this, so that's what I'm going to use. Um, blue button is something. This button's something. This button's... There's a lot of buttons. Okay, it loaded. Oh, look at that animation. It's quite nice. Ooh. I need to kill this portal. I think I need to kill this portal. Definitely making more creatures. And they're all creatures I'm afraid of. I feel like a pretty badass character. I like the sound effects. Alright, this thing. Uh, uh. Get out of here, fire. Wolf. Okay. It looked like as I was hitting the portal, it got smaller, and then only smaller um, fears could come out of it. And if that's the way it works, that's a very cool concept. If I was just imagining it, that, that's alright too. There's coins. I don't even have to get them all, but I am. Um... Let's see if the portal gets smaller. The portal does seem to get smaller. That's pretty cool. Really nice game. Next. We're playing bombs! Which is a really weird size for a game. I've now placed a bomb and killed myself. Alright, that, that was good. I think I'm meant to like place bombs, run away, and then come back and make our way to that like treasure. Ooh. Bam, by slime. I lost another life and I have no idea why. Boxes appear randomly, the AI makes it more difficult for the player to move and for the enemy. Oh wait, that time I didn't drop a box, I dropped a treasure chest. Oh, maybe it, it, the bombs look like treasure chests. Alright. I like placing lots of bombs. That's probably not the best strategy. That's what I like doing. Okay. Bam. It's quite fun just destroying stuff. Ooh, that's the time tempo. 
I'm not gonna make it to the end. Darn slimes. This is another pretty fun game. Next. We're playing Last Defender. I had to play. Yeah, we there's a whole picture of a of a keyboard here. What? Um up, down, left, right, space. I'm gonna pretend that's right. Okay. Last defender. Did I say laser defender? Maybe it's last defender. I'm unsure what I said. Oh. That's this far as different cannons out. I'm just throwing stuff out into space. Machine gun. I'm not sure if I'm doing well. I can't seem to move unless I tap a lot and then it only moves a little bit. Um, something at a time? Yeah. Oh, okay, do I move where my mouse is? Nope. I don't really know. I mean, I defended the city last time, so I mean, surely I'll be able to defend the city again. Probably. It's those sh giant shield things. I feel like I've used all of my other guns. And yeah, that's not moving with anything. But I won again! <laughs> Next. We're playing Vibor, probably. I don't know. Alright. Oh, so it's like Snake. Alright. So, th this game was also made for a different gem, and in that gem you had to make like these weird sized games, and that's why it's like super long. And I'm playing a little snake. Oh, <laughs> damn, I suck. It knows I suck, it gave me a blank room. <laughs> Inside Jupiter, you're not good. Nope, and again, I went too early. Nope. Wasn't paying attention. Right. This is a pretty interesting take on Snake. Having Snake go through all of these different super long rooms with not a whole lot of room for air. I'm doing well. Snake. Ah, oh, darn it, there's only one more area than I would have gone on to the next one. Next. We're playing Box Dragon. That's a really cute, like, moving title screen. Oh, he just, like, killed my friend. Lo siento. Isn't that I'm sorry? Oh, I'm sorry, it's not done. Let's do this one. It's fine. Ooh, is this sort of like that, like... I don't know, Bomberman. What was the name of the game that went like this? I think I'm supposed to squish them. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's really satisfying when you squish enemies with boxes. Why? Who knows? Come here. Alright, come here. Bam! Awesome. And that unlocks the next level. That's really nice. Ah, should probably go this way. Oh, we can push more than one box? No. Yes, yes we can. Okay, that's interesting. Come this way. Also you. Ah, oh, it's too late. Maybe not, maybe Bunny will come. There you go. And we'll destroy this character. We just need this slime to come forward. They did, but I had already pushed the box. Ah, oh, now it's off the screen. Alright, it looks like I'll need to go this way and push this one. Bam. I like the little dragon sprite as well. Very cute. Next. We're playing attack. Ah, we need to run. Look at those little dinosaurs! They looked adorable. Dinosaur, they're not dinosaurs, they're definitely just monsters. Oh, I'm so cute. 
I'm that like little Game Boy from Adventure Time, yeah. These dinosaurs, these I keep calling them dinosaurs, and they look nothing like dinosaurs. But these little creatures, I wish I could shoot wherever my mouse is pointing, but I can't. I can only shoot what's in front of me, and these like monsters are totally way faster than me at turning. I don't know what to do about it. Ugh. So just go. They're just faster than me. Ugh. 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 These graphics are super adorable, though. I very much like them. I just can't survive very long. <laughs> Because I'm not very good at this game. Just keep keep firing, keep firing stuff. They're catching up though, and they're gonna kill me. Next, we're playing the new asteroids. All right. Oh, our bullets stay alive. So be careful. Pretty sure all of my bullets are going to kill me. They don't seem to affect me actually. So that's very good. So it's meant to be like asteroids but with updated graphics. This is a really neat idea. I like the effect of destroying the meteors. It's not exactly um, like an explosion, but instead it's sort of an explosion of stars. And I think that's really a nice, a nice update. I like stars. I like that I can just shoot off bullets, they don't hurt me. Although I'm getting way less of a multiplier. Yeah, but I stay alive. Darn. <laughs> Dead. The spaceships shot me. Spaceships kind of look like bugs. Next. We're playing Encutra uh, Smiley. Which is like, find the smiley. Where's Waldo? It's inspired by where's Waldo? And find the hidden object. Uh, oh wait. There's a smiley. Oh, so it only appears when my, like, mouse is over it. That's interesting. Oh, there's one. There's one. This is an interesting way of doing it, so I can't see it without putting my mouse over it. Oh, there you go. Where's the obvious place to put smileys? There's you. Oh, there we go. I won. That's a very cute little game. I enjoyed it. It's a cool concept to have that sort of magnifying glass find it. Next. Last, but certainly not least, we're playing I Wish. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Yep. So this description says something about the complication of um, wanting a coin to Do you wish? Um, I don't know. Well, I think I lost. Second of December. I think we want to get to the line. No, that also killed us. Oh, the third one's a jump. Right? There's the fourth one a jump. I'm trying to figure out when my coin sort of jumps. So if you hold down space, something different happens. I didn't want to go that way. Mm -hmm. Not being very good at this game. I very much like the, the look of everything. One, two... Yeah, it still didn't make it. Mm. It's an interesting idea. I feel like there's probably a lot behind it that I can't quite read. But anyway, um, check out any of these games that interest you. The links will be in the description. Thank you very much for watching and liking and commenting. Bye!